The Eastern Eagles boys varsity basketball team is off to an 0-5 start to the season, but don't let the record fool you. This team is full of hard workers and they're seeking a return to former glory. On February 19th, 2020, the Eastern Eagles took down the Notre Dame Titans in the sectional semifinal. Flash forward to December 2021 and they have not won a game since. Coach David Kite believes his young team is knocking on the door of that elusive victory. I know that they feel pressure. I wish that they didn't. Um, I told my wife that the other day, I wish I could take <laughs> the pressure from them, but I can't. But I really, I firmly believe that they're close to knocking down the door. And when that happens, uh, they'll get the little monkey off their back, so to speak. And then it'll be um, much brighter days for Eastern Eagles. While they are still in search of that elusive win, the Eagles do have some talented young playmakers that could help the team compete. Jace Bullington sustained an injury last season, but he's a bright young big who is trying to help lead the team through the challenges they may face this season. Keep pushing forward, keep teaching the younger kids what, what we're taught to do and get everyone in the role of things. Braden O'Brien is another junior who is trying to make his mark. He feels that the biggest asset the Eagles have is their team defense, which all stems from the togetherness they have in the locker room. Well, we, have a, we have a lot of heart. Our defense is probably our key key aspect. Like we just we don't we try not to give up too much, like and just keep pounding it out. Make sure to keep giving the effort hundred percent all the time, every day. No matter how we feel after a loss, especially like Meg's, we just come back out and keep working. One thing that's clear when looking at these Eagles is that the team is a tight knit group. There are no egos, no big shots, and no one's above the team. We don't have selfishness. I mean, we, if anything, we're too unselfish sometimes on the floor, which I think speaks to the friendships that they have off the floor. They like hanging out together. Um, they've all basically grown up together. Um, While they may still be winless on the season, don't bet against Eastern pulling off an upset or two in the TVC Hawking. While they may not be the most talented team in our coverage, they're certainly up there in terms of heart. For Hardwood Heroes, I'm Ethan Sargent, reminding you to be heroic.